Change of taste for wine connoisseurs. Kosher wine is fast becoming a preference. As CBS 2's Scott Rappaport tells us, people are noticing. It is a celebration of wine and food par excellence. The wine is the best. Yup, the vino is primo, some of it very high end. How much can a bottle of wine go for here? Well, Scott, easily can go for $200. But it's not exactly what you might think. All the wines that you see here on display and ripe for the tasting are kosher and a far cry from your old Passover wine. More than 350 different kinds from all over the world New Zealand, Italy, Australia. All part of the 10th annual kosher food and wine experience here at Chelsea Piers. More than 40 vendors selling to buyers from around the globe. The wines complemented by kosher dishes from gourmet restaurants. So what is kosher wine exactly? Very simple. From the crushing of the grape until the bottle is sealed, the entire process is handled and overseen by an observant Jewish crew. There's no gelatin and no non-wine yeast. Experts say the kosher wine business is a burgeoning industry. Doing $28 million a year in sales and growing. Top end kosher winemakers showing their best at this exclusive preview. Herzog Wines touting its limited edition camouflage made from 12 different varieties. There's Tepperberg's Essence Cabernet, one of the best wines from one of Israel's largest wineries. Even kosher champagne from the venerable Rothschild family, as in Baron de Rothschild, makers of Mouton and Lafitte. Clearly, this is not your grandparents' kosher wine. Now you have wines from the finest vineyards in Italy, France, and especially California. The next generation of kosher wines available right now. Scott Rappaport, CBS 2 News.